Welcome to Knee the Curve, the point of most extreme change. I'm Emmett Short. Elon Musk's brain-computer interface company Neuralink stunned the world last year when a monkey was able to play the video game Pong simply by thinking about it. Personally, I would have been almost as stunned if I saw it playing Pong using the joystick. I had no idea monkeys understood Pong as a concept, so I don't know about you, I'm going to stop eating them. It's going to be tough. They are so good. Uh, Neuralink might do clinical trials this year. They posted this job posting, director of clinical trials. Um, the monkey is pissed. It was in line for that promotion, but it was forced out of the company when a video montage surfaced of it repeatedly using the N-word. I think that's the same monkey. Crypto.com's debit card and trading platform is far and away my favorite. They have the highest staking percentages, 14% on stable coins. That's crazy. The most cash back of any card, and they give you free Netflix and Spotify and Amazon, depending on your level. I don't have a deal with them. I just love them, and you can make 25 bucks if you use my link. Musk initially promised to test Neuralink's brain-computer interface on humans in 2020, then pushed it to 2021, and now 2022. Believe what you want. Want, but three years late is right around the sweet spot for Elon's predictions, so I tend to buy it. There is a company called Synchron who has already begun human trials. Its device is a little different. It accesses the organ through blood vessels and leaves the electrodes in the walls of the vasculature instead of penetrating into the sensitive bulk tissue to the brain. Their tech does work though. This is the CEO, Thomas Oxley, and this is his Twitter. This guy, Philip O'Keefe, who pioneered their tech, took over Tom Oxley's Twitter. No keystrokes needed or voices. I created this tweet just by thinking about it. He said he was gonna answer questions and then I don't know if they had a glitch because he is nowhere to be seen in this comment thread. Something went wrong. This guy, Max Hodeck, who left Neuralink under mysterious circumstances, and now he's personally invested in Synchron. They wanna say his investment speaks louder than words, maybe, but I'm guessing he also has plenty of stock left in Neuralink. Now, in case you're a skeptic, you will love this article by The Daily Beast. If the goal is to use the acquired brain data for other devices or use these devices for other things, say to drive cars, to drive Teslas, nobody's gonna be using their Neuralink to drive their self-driving car. All those human research subjects, people with genuine needs, are being exploited. Best exploitation ever. Hey, if I'm paralyzed and you can fix me, please, exploit the shit out of me. Neuralink and BCIs in general could be the most civilization shifting technology ever developed. It's scary. So I totally get why civilization would rather distract themselves with like how insensitive the Eminem characters are. Like she's too sexy, they say. They're promoting unrealistic body ideals. That, that one's true. Nobody is that perfectly round. One day. <laughs> Look, as a species, it seems obvious this tech is going to make us healthier and smarter, probably richer, um, safer. Ah, probably not. Like right now, my brain is air gapped, right? You got to hack me through my eyes and my ears. It's called marketing. It works, but there's a lot of collateral damage. But will this tech make us happier as a species? Definitely. Yeah, there's a button for that. It's just happy, 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 happy. Is it an existential threat? Probably, but it could stop the other existential threat of a rogue AI taking over the planet. So hopefully they cancel out. Watch this video to stay up to speed on how fast you're being left behind. Leave your thoughts in the comments, even the weird ones, especially the weird ones. I have algorithmic Stockholm syndrome, so like and share, or take it to the next level and join Patreon and help make high tech low brow. And if you wanna be a part of the team and write jokes, DM me on Twitter and Discord. Click subscribe or let the AI radicalize you, your choice. See you in the future.